Hello guys, and welcome back! For last left off, we drove off one invasion to welcome another from Libya. You know what? I'm gonna see what I can do with diplomacy. Maybe I can get Libya gone! Because I was planning to make them a puppet state anyway to have a barrier against Egypt. So I'm gonna see if I can make them a protectorate of puppet state. Let's see if they'll accept peace. It might have to be after I destroy this last army. Apparently, balance of power is equal. Which I the guess is true, because I've only got one reliable army. Not gonna happen, apparently. Uh, Egypt, I know about you now. Trade is low. I'm not paying you for the privilege, because I don't have the money. Let's uh, just go through diplomacy. I haven't been on this in a while. So let's go for this. Athens. Nope. Nope. Uh, that, that, that's it. <laughs> that's everyone. The others either hate me or are at war. So. Good round of diplomacy. Right. That's your command. So back to the, the war front. Uh, I am healing up. I should easily be able to repel this army. In fact, some of them even hurt. Uh, you guys heal up. That's fine. And Carthage. You do not need such a garrison, but I guess I still need to maintain order here. I can't afford another rebellion. Uh, so, next turn. Will anything happen? They've retreated into the desert. They're, they are gone. There's also a Libyan Navy. Crap! Ah, right, so... Elephants! We're facing elephants! Uh, I've, I, I have a few pikemen. Right, so elephants, tons of Carthaginian hoplites, Libyan peltists, Numidian gentlemen, Carthaginian fins, and a fleet which... I... Doubt I'm gonna be able to defend against. I have not started my timer, I'm starting it now. So, let's go. I don't like my chances. Seriously, this time, really don't like my chances. I, I've healed up a little bit, I think. I think I have. Uh, certainly lost a lot of my militia. So, we're gonna have to see how well I can hold out this time. Again, if I can wheel my cavalry out and back tack all the hoplites. We should have this. Otherwise, this this definitively might be it. This might be what kills me. So we'll have to see how well this goes. The Leviathans. Okay, so same strategy. Abandon the uh, market square to go to the town center here, or this state. Ships, face out, destroy what you can, not necessarily the biggest ship, just try and sink as many men as you can, so that's your job. Next, trying to form up what I have, so, need the best troops I can. Though I've got to leave some, haven't I? So like this, uh, pikes. I think that's a good place for you, right. So, like this, form up. Nope, not like that. Not quite. Okay. You're on the corner, that... Hopefully that won't... get you killed. We'll do it like this. Hopefully that'll work out. So, this... is group one. So I don't get it mixed up, that's... the front line. So next line... It's like the... this is a much larger front here. You'll be like this. Phalanx, like that. That's group two. Next group is the back line here. We have no reserves, well, no hoplite reserves at least. This is an all or nothing vin. We'll have mob, as usual in reserve. We have a peltist. We have a slinner on each side. Turn off skirmishing for all of these. By your command. Ready and waiting. 
You guys will group up. We'll have cavalry, even the general groups up. We'll have the reserves grouped up. And I'll leave you as separate units. So you guys are here. Be inside. We'll need you. Uh, don't skirmish, but fire at will. We'll probably need it. Okay. Battle begins at sea. Let us begin. So where's their army? Their army should be walking in, I suppose. Since they attack with the navy and not the army, so... It's the army that'll be counted as reinforcements. Reinforcements. Right, so if I can sink 60 men with... Seven men, that would be considered a great success. So let's see what I can do. Cool! That's one. In fact, that's two. So you, turn around, aim for that. Uh... Aim for that. You might be able to rescue your comrades. Ah, uh, never mind. <laughs> no, never mind. Right, we got two. That's like a hundred-ish men dead. So that's that's a good trade-off. Now we have... An entire unit has perished. What? 160, 170 javelin throwers just outside of range. When they land, I can send my cavalry out, hopefully. In the meantime, we have... Trouble. In the form of African elephants. I'm sick of dealing with these guys. I want my own elephants. Why am I always fighting other elephants? Although, my god, they've sent it out really far. We can have this. It's the other forces are lagging so far behind we might be able to kill the general right now. So, if we can just rush out the uh, skirmishing cavalry that I have, we might have this. Stay in rift formation! Do not break formation, even if this cavalry charge and through. You, uh, that is hardly a phalanx. You're really far out. Hopefully it'll reform. I don't want to reform the line. I'll reform the line. Fine. And the double. Oh my god, yes, it, it's so far out! This general is headstrong, he's like, I've heard the, they'll have like 60 people in the town, let's go in and kill them all. Wait, what's that? Oh no, Nobidians! Quick men, throw your javel- oh god. Right, so, that will hopefully turn out perfect. Kill the general. Which one's the general? That man, obviously. Oh, but the god, how, how are you alive? <laughs> this got through your chest. Got one through the elephant's ears. The enemy general is dead. Amazing. Good. This is a perfect start. And now we have the actual general come around in a few moments. Uh, we just need to finish mopping up the rest of the elephants. Then we'll move back. Are they lined up? They are. Good. Kill them. Okay, good. They're gone. Fall back. You've done amazing work. Our general is under attack. General's under attack. That's fine for now. Drive off those Libyan hoplites. Is that... Is that gonna be a big pain? No, no, okay, finally. Now that's fully abandoned, it's not gonna be... Just... Fire and fire arrows at me. So you guys fall all the way back. We've taken out, hopefully, this entire javelin group. Just finish them off quickly before they get here. In fact, uh, scratch that. Come back. Uh, a swift charge will probably do us a world of good here. Finish off the navy. Kill the the other general, which is the admiral. By coming in from all sides with cavalry. And also stop any unnecessary deaths that might happen. Oh yeah, so that tower is just gonna constantly shoot at me. Is it? Yeah, it is. It's gonna be a big pain, I can't actually deal with that. I never knew that I could do that, I, I need to take that into account. Just a autonomous tower that will always fight. General. Anyway, perfect! Dealt with! Now! Back into the town! I think that's just about... Is that... Did we even leave any alive? Five! I didn't hear the Admiral die. Is the Admiral dead? 
Just, uh, make sure he's dead. I don't think that guy's an admiral. Okay, good. Okay, so. The only people left is the infantry, the few peltists they have, and one lot of Carthaginian cavalry, if I remember correctly. The hoplites. The hoplites are really far ahead of the skirmishers. The skirmishers are the lagging far behind. I could probably take you guys out for spin to attack the uh, peltists at the back. Probably better than having you cooped up. I'll uh, keep the general there for morale purposes. And there is the, uh, the cavalry versed in to the wall of spears. Uh, hold, hold. Don't, don't waste your ammo. Just let them die on their own. They're not gonna get through that wall. Also, maybe I should move this up. I should probably move this line up a little bit. It's a bit late now, though. Wait, no, it's not. Move it, move it up just a bit, just a tad, so that's out of the circle. Right, all of you move around. Good. This defense will hopefully work. Okay, hold the line. That's all you need to do. These mercenaries are gonna be working for that pay. If you come around the side, you just need to hold the line. That's all. I am so good at defense. Offensives, I seem to lose a lot of men. Defensives, I'm fairly decent. Especially when there's towns and terrain to work with. Instead of just flat, open fields where we can get flanked. Now what's here? So, they're actually sending men down here. Only two groups. I'm still hoping I can come around, slam into what's over here, the Libyan Peltists. E even if it's hit or run, just slam into them, run out. Uh, you guys, I don't know how many men are going to be attacking over here, so move up. Also, you're being shot by the fire arrow. There's nothing I can do about that. And I'll never run out of ammo, so... Hit and run, hit and run, keep moving. Charge into their backs. And charge way out. So it's it's fluid, keep it moving. Keep it moving. Maybe even come around the back of these guys and just kill them all. Maybe not kill them all, but to give it a good go at least. How are we doing? Are we holding the line? Is holding, but I'm gonna throw in the reserves now. I can always strip. I could probably strip a guy off of here if need be. So quickly slam into their backs before this peltist comes around the corner. They're they're doing a good job because they're avoiding the pikes. If I turn this pike unit around. Be able to get him in the back. Like this! Ha-ha! Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Okay, don't no need to worry about that, because that's only the peasants. The peasants don't matter. Peasants are only there to fill in the ranks for like five seconds. So like this, we'll be able to like completely box off this side. That's perfect. Uh, how are we doing here? Decent enough. Keep moving on. Don't stay in a prolonged engagement. Especially with these guys. They're uh, pretty well armored for skirmishing units. So keep moving. Keep it fluid. We did shake them up quite a bit. I'm hoping we'll be able to hold that line until we come around again. Uh, I think I'm fairly sure we can hold this until the cavalry can make its its way around. Numidians really took a pound in there. Wow. Uh, I need my heavy cavalry out. Alright, so time for One the general to come around. All, its all the way around. 
kill what he can. Digging into those Carthagian hoplites. I don't think we're going to be attacked here, so I'm going to move these guys in. Out again. Join in, General. You'll be on the next strike. Okay. And back in! Go! Charge! Oh, you're trying to outflank them. Reform. Try and reform at least. You guys come in and help. Okay, cavalry in, cavalry out. Go. We've almost broke that ca Carthagian hoplite unit. We lose a lot of men every time. But we should be able to break this left flank and then bring all those hoplites off to bear. And then we'll be able to bring the cavalry again and win the match. Also, I told you to move, didn't I? Get, get going. Okay, don't break there, men. We're in. Okay, general. General, right. War cry. Drive him off. Intimidate. Good. We've, we've done it. Right. So, uh... Was it you? It was you. Right. Move in. Go help out. Got the cavalry charging into the pikes. Exactly what I want them to do. So see if you can finish them off. I don't want to see another Libyan army. If we beat them here, hopefully they'll come to terms. So you guys, come out. And you guys go over there. Very methodical about this. There's, there's a set strategy, there's a set way to do this. There's 20... I don't know if I can let 20 go. Uh, the eight Numidian mercenaries that are left will hunt them down. The Tarantines and the General will go for the back tech. For the coup de grace! Come on! Oh, so that is the end of this part! So, thanks for watching, folks. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you for the coup de grace. See you then.